Greg, thank you very much for joining us to share your thoughts about 4D and digital space. 4D, I mean the expectation that the deliverables we create, drawings in CAD and models in BIM and geospatial representations in GIS, they will be part of the digital DNA over the longevity, the life cycle of operating infrastructure assets that begin as our projects. So the, the, the notion is that we're advancing what we're already doing and as we synchronize their changes and keep them up to date with the changing reality of the assets, we'll have digital twins that underlie and federate for digital cities and can be connected together in ways that we'll discover as we, as we advance from here. What do you think about evolving role of GIS and BIM and especially the convergence of these technologies adding value to the infrastructure and city? Well, the digital twin isn't the twin if it doesn't have the 3D reality. We say 4D because actual assets change constantly and need to be maintained fit for purpose. Uh, the point is that the capture of reality, uh, and we would say reality modeling enables that. So it's the drone photography, it's the laser scans where necessary. And you know, we've introduced the acquisition of Orbit GT and announced that here uh, for mobile mapping to be part of a continuous survey, I like to say 4D surveying, that really, I think, brings uh, geospatial technologies up to right time, regularly surveyed and, and changed synchronized. Our other acquisition announced here is also important for digital cities and mobility digital twins, we could say, which is the acquisition of city labs. So what is the genesis of uh, digital construction works and what's your vision behind it? Well, the digital construction works is a joint venture between Bentley and Topcon where we have seconded people who, were, who are experts in both construction and software and hardware technologies respectively. And their mission is not to create software, or they'll be doing some digital integration, but to accelerate the take up of constructioneering, where engineering and construction are done together. They need to be inventing new workflows on construction sites where you presume you have a 4D construction digital twin and go about the work differently. It's, it's, the point is that we can't just optimize what we're doing now. We need to step back from the big picture as digital construction works will be able to do. And it's now at the service uh, of literally and providing services for constructors and mega projects.